Okay. So what you're wanting to do first is go to facebook.com forward slash frames forward slash manage. And from here, this is going to be where you add in your logo. So click open frame studio. And then once this opens, you're going to go ahead and select if you want to create this as a frame for a profile picture or if you want it for a Facebook camera. So Facebook camera is what we're going to be using when we go like lives using frames. So what you'll want to do is click upload art and go ahead and find your logo. And let's go ahead and upload it. So let's see, we're going to use this Unleash Your Inner Legend one. So what you'll want to do is go ahead and position it. And if you want to see what it looks like on a phone or, you know, a portrait or landscape, you can kind of go over there and see it. So you want to make sure too that obviously you don't cover up the entire frame so that you don't cover your face. So as you can see, this is how it's going to look this way or this way. So once you get it positioned or you can also, you know, do it at the bottom corner showing it kind of cut off on that side. So perfect. So once you get it to where you like it, go ahead and click next, click available every um, anywhere, or if you only want it in a specific location, um, but I'm just going to put available anywhere. You want to make it active right away. And if you want some keywords, so like for here, you can put like the name unleash your inner legend. And then down here in the keywords, I'm going to put unleash your inner legend. And then if you want to add more, just put your, your comma or your or hit enter and then type in like podcast, so on and so forth. Click next. And then once you make sure that everything is good to go, go ahead and click publish. So it's going to be publishing right now. And now I'm going to show you how to take this and use this when you go live on your phone. Okay, so what you want to do is click live and this is going to be how to do it on the mobile. Now click at the, the little wand button, go at the very bottom, go four over and click the frame and then you're going to find your frame here.